everyone, it's Megan and today I'm going to be doing a pack with me video. I am going to be going on a trip for quite a long time. The main reason I'm going on the trip is because I'm going to be going to a church convention that I go to every year and it's going to be an eight day convention but before that I am going to my grandma and grandpa's and um because they live in pennsylvania and the church convention is in pennsylvania but it's gonna be quite a long trip so i have a lot of packing to do and plan out and i've always wanted to do a pack for me video so i thought this is the perfect time to do that first i'll say i've kind of been planning how many outfits or so i want to figure out i'm i'm gonna i'm someone who i figure out the outfits like i don't just like pack everything and then figure out the outfits there. I figure out the outfits before. I'm just do a really extensive and long packing job. So yeah, and you'll see how that works. Basically, I have written down here that I'm gonna have 11 days where I'm gonna need church outfits um, because I go to church every single day of the convention um, and then I go to church every Saturday. So I'm gonna have 11 church outfits um and I have the plus three because there's going to be three out three times I go to church before I leave for the trip and so I kind of want to figure out those two and then there's going to be 21 days I guess of other outfits and uh but I don't really know exactly if that's going to be the number because I never know what days that I go to church that I may not end up changing out of my church clothes ever um, so I decided I'll figure out 16 and also just by the way I am wearing my pajamas right now so that I can have all my clothes you know ready to just for me to see what I want to pack basically and so I think I'll start with the church outfits because that seems like it'd be the easiest to do I'm still gonna make it really complicated because I always make things really complicated but I think it'll be the easiest so I'll start there this is what you see when you come in my room um, yeah, so I have all my dresses here, some decorations there, hats there, um, I have chokers up there, um, pants down here, and all my shoes on the bottom. So yeah, I think I'm just gonna go to the dresses first and take those out, which ones I think I might want to bring on the trip, and then I'll probably go to my skirts over here and then look at tops that I might want to wear with them. I'm probably just going to end up taking out like almost everything and then having to just put tons back. Basically, yeah, let's just do that. Let's like take out almost everything that I like. I already have like, like more than half my dresses it looks like. I don't know. Oh, I'm insane. Oh, and then over here I have some new stuff um, that I want to think about bringing. So yeah, <laughs> look. Look, I barely have anything left. Uh, I'll probably go through all those dresses again and just make sure um, that I really want to maybe bring those or not. And then here's my skirts. So I'm just going to bring my skirts. So now I think I have a little bit of room to put the tops there. Okay, here's where I go crazy because obviously, you know, fall and winter fashion is what I love. And so I'm going to be able to actually wear like my sweaters there and everything. So I'm going to go crazy with bringing my turtlenecks and my cable knit and everything. Um, but right now I just need to think about what I might wear to church. I feel like I should almost just take this whole tech. Or I might even do my regular outfits on another day. I probably will because it's already taking a really long time, which I knew it would. But look at this. I'm barely even. Oh, Megan. And now let's look at button ups. I'll have to look at jackets too because I mean some of the jackets might be actually like the main star of the outfit or whatever to church if I wear a basic dress or whatever so here oh hey butterball hi hey baby do you want to help me pack you love sleeping in clothes so yeah you're gonna love it there yep and you're gonna go on my skirts great don't mess up the black ones okay let me just bring all my plain colored buns. Here I go with my biggest weakness, my jackets. I don't know how many jackets am I gonna bring. I don't know. <laughs> All of them? Let me just think of what I might wear to church. So, cropped leather jacket. I wear to church a lot. Here we go with the blazers. These blazers are another weak spot of mine, as is all jackets, but you know. 
Oh my, I'm insane. Look at this. Like, this is more clothes than some people own, like, in their whole entire wardrobe. And I'm just seeing what I want to pack. Oh, Megan. I am in major trouble here. What do I do? Okay. Hmm. This whole video is just going to be me, like, struggling. Ugh. I love packing. I do. But I drive myself insane when I pack. Let me look at the jackets, because I'm only going to bring so many jackets, and I still don't know if I'm going to bring, like, a denim jacket or whatever. Um, let me look at my casual jackets and make sure there's not any that I might bring that, because I'll... So that's one jacket I might bring for casual jackets. Probably not going to bring it in my denim, um, but no, my Cordigari teal jacket, one of my favorite jackets. I might bring that. So that's two casual ones I may bring. This one's basically like a coat. It's probably be good to just bring that. So that's three over there that I might think about bringing and I have eight, nine here. Okay, let's put them back. What <sighs> about my metallic ones? No. They're too statement. I won't want to wear them as, I won't wear them as often as the other stuff and I need to wear stuff often here with going on a trip for like about three or four weeks. Nope. Sorry, cardigan. Oh wait, and I have another jacket. Ah, oh, I have another jacket I'm definitely bringing because I got my first ever suit and I'm bringing that suit. So that's 10 jackets. I need to like half that. Maybe I should color coordinate all this stuff on here. So I know like what colors I'm maybe bringing. Oh, that's what I should do. I need to look at my shoes and see what shoes I'm also going to be bringing so that I know what I might be styling with. Okay, I'll do that. Wow, this video is looking really grainy. What's going on with it? I'm sorry if the quality is somehow messing up. Definite yes shoes. There's no question about those. Um, I guess I should take out my casual shoes though to see what the full, like this whole front row I want to take. But... That's a problem. I'll probably have to narrow down all my colors because I color coordinate everything. So this is kind of what I need to figure out is what colors am I going to bring. Because like I have, I want to, you know, if I bring navy stuff, I want to bring my navy boots. If I bring gray stuff, I want to bring my gray boots. If I bring white stuff, I want to bring my white boots. I may just narrow it out white from what I'm bringing, possibly. Because I mean, I don't know. I don't know, I love those boots though. Not bringing those boots, not bringing my Oxfords, probably bringing my boot heels. These are my newest shoes that I just got yesterday that I was actually wearing until I, you know, changed out of clothes. I love these so much. These were a gift from my mom because like pretty much most of the shoes I wear are boots and so she said I, I want yet another pair of church shoes that are not boots um, that you'll wear and that you'll bring on the trip. So I'm definitely bringing those and I love those. Um, no cream shoes, I guess. Yeah, I don't really have much cream there anyway, but Ideal Converse, ugh, my favorite. Like, oh, I love these. Move those back. Oh, um, I want to buy my Mary Janes. Oh, my Mary Janes that are back there because this fell. Probably not. They're not the most comfortable, but I love them. Okay, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ah, ha, ha. I probably need to do this down to like five as well. Well, first, one, yes, two, yes, three, yes, maybe I can bring six, I guess I should put these back, these are like my most worn church shoes, but, I mean, I'm going to be having, I wear these church, I wear those to church, and I really want to bring some other colors, and so I can wear these to church, so maybe... Maybe, but I kind of bring Converse. I'm gonna say no, the white boots, even though they're like one of my favorite shoes ever. I haven't been wearing them as much recently, and I think, I mean, they're not the most comfortable out of all of them, and I guess I should bring my most comfortable. I have narrowed it down to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, still seven. Maybe I can bring six. But I really want my teal Converse as well. But I'm bringing those Converse, but teal is my favorite color. And I kind of want to wear teal a lot because, I mean, teal's my favorite color, but I can't wear these to church. I think I might think on this a little bit more. Yeah. 
So that means I can take all the white stuff out. You guys should color coordinate this like I was thinking. See how much of each color I'm bringing and how much would I wear that color. Because like for me, guest style is also a big important thing for me, but color is also one of the most important things um, for me because I'm always color coordinating. So teal. And then there's a teal jacket. So really that's not that much teal that I'd be bringing. So should I X out my teal converse? Keep those there. I probably won't bring my jacket then. And I'll X out the teal converse, which is painful. But it has to be done. Something has to be done. I can't bring my whole wardrobe. Light blue is like becoming, like I think I said it was like my favorite color. I think it's becoming almost like my second favorite color, but um, I'll just leave the cable knit there for right now. I don't have a turtleneck of light blue. I wish I did. Extra colors. Stay safe. And these are my new dresses there. And here's my amazing suit that I will be showing you later. And I definitely have to put it in a haul because it's like one of the best thrift finds I've ever found. It's so amazing. In fact, I didn't find it. My mom found it for me. I was so happy. Thank you, mom. Or maybe I should put... I don't know. I'm just rambling here. Like, the whole video has been rambling. Who am I talking about? I should probably do, like, yeses first. Just be like, okay, yes, 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 yes. So that I know I'm going to keep those. This is going to be a really long video. Part one is going to be really long. What am I... How was I thinking I was going to get this one part video when I'm taking so long with just my church clothes, which should be the easiest. Hopefully this is entertaining for you guys. My new sweater dress. It's going. I know, Butterball. You are just wondering about me. You were like, what is she doing? She's gone insane. I am. I have gone insane. I've always been insane. Black turn black, black cable knit, black t-shirt, black long sleeve t-shirt. I am bringing those. Black blazer. I am bringing. Need to narrow down the floral print dresses. Remember when I used to hate floral print? Yeah, me either. This one is really too short, but I wear it with hose and flats, and it looks really pretty, and it's one of my favorite dresses, but I kind of need to pick between these two. So I feel like I should bring that one because it's actually long enough so I won't have to worry about even wearing hose if I don't want to. So I guess this is the yes. Let me look at the jackets then because I have three yes jackets. One maybe. Two maybe. Three maybe. Four maybe. Oh wait, I forgot about this jacket and I forgot that I'm bringing my- oh, I need to put these in the yes. Oh, oh, Megan, why am I going to bring this to myself? Eh. Okay, so that's four jackets under a yes. This jacket is causing me so much problems because it's like, it's one of my all-time favorite jackets, so I feel like I should bring it, but again, it's kind of like with the metallic jackets. I wear it a lot. I could wear it with so many outfits, but would I want to wear it with so many outfits? Because, I mean, I'm going to be with a lot of the same people the whole time, so it's going to be like, okay, I'm wearing that jacket again. I'm going to be harsh. Okay, so I've moved the colorful babies onto the bed, but this is going to be a no. Still don't know about those, still don't know about the gray blazers, still don't know about those black stuff. Because I am indecisive. I feel like I should say no to this skirt, because, I mean, I'm bringing other fall print stuff. And I just realized I've been saying feast, and probably some of you are like, what's a feast? Like, some of you will probably be like, yeah, that's what the convention is called, I guess. And yeah, you'd be right. Feast of Tabernacles, we just call it Feast most of the time, or FOT. This one's probably a yes, depending on how many dresses I have over there. I have way too many probably already, and I'm still going to have to narrow down, even though they're technically my yeses. So I have four maybes here. My blue cable knit, my pink turtleneck, my kind of tealish green dress, and my gray blazer. And I still don't know what to do. I think I'll leave all these here. And these will be my maybes for when I'm trying stuff on. Which means I'm going to need to start trying stuff on right now. Oh man. I'm, am I ready for this? Oh, I guess I'm going to have to be. Wait, what? I still have the tag in this. I've had this for like a year. Oh my. There, it's on medium. There we go. That will help me a whole lot when trying on these sweaters and everything. 
Okay, I'm gonna start with all the dresses and then look at separates and everything. Uh, um, sorry that this mirror isn't the best and I'm not in the best light, but this gives me like total 60s vibes. Like this is complete 60s, but look at that cap with this, you know, this like slightly flare mini skirt knit dress and then these heels. It's just, and, and the tights, like tights were such a big thing. Um, so I'm going with full on 60s outfit with this, so I'm gonna go take a picture of this. dress I thought for sure would be a yes, but I'm not liking it as much as I thought I would. This is my amazing dress that I wore to my church's spring formal that I got for one dollar. And I thought for sure I'd wear it with my ankle boots again like I did before, because I thought I'd like never find anything I liked better with it. But it has the scallops up here. And so I have my new shoes that have scallops on them. And yes, I know it looks a little bit weird because those are sticking out, but I'm too lazy to put them, you know, in right now. Okay, and yeah, I already took my shoes off, but I think I found a lighting situation that works. I finally found a way to turn the light on, so I'm guessing this is better. And I'm sorry I did not have it on with the first two outfits, but yeah. So this is my third yes outfit. Um, I can also wear this dress casually, which is great. I'd probably wear it with my black and white combers and like my striped choker and everything. But yeah, I just have my ankle boots, my white brim hat, and a choker, and yeah, this dress. I love so much. Okay, so this was my prom dress and I have decided to bring it and I'll probably wear it when I have my solo. So now I just need to decide whether I want it with my boots or heels. Um, yeah, that looks really good. I am so shocked about these heels. Like, I knew I'd love them and wear them a lot, but they're three out of the four outfits so far. Like, I cannot believe that. My boots are my favorite shoes ever. But... These are just working with everything. My mom's going to be so happy that I'm wearing them this much because she really wants me to stop wearing boots all the time. But I probably never will stop that. But I'm doing well so far. And I know I said I wasn't going to do separates yet, but I had a black top and my black skirt on. So I thought, okay, why not try, you know, my colorful jacket with it. Maybe I'll try another jacket. But I decided to try a jacket on with my navy dress and navy boots and everything and I'm gonna like it this way too but I feel like I like it with the black better but the navy is a little bit different than the other stuff it looks cooler in some ways and this outfit is literally just switching to my navy blazer rather than the green blazer um but I really like it and I realized I forgot to even try on my gray blazer with the other outfits so I guess it means to know and now this dress. Already worn it like this before, but this is one of my favorite church outfits probably ever. So I'll probably wear this again. Okay, I have another outfit I like the green jacket with. Okay, I like it with my gray turtleneck and my gray boots. It's the first outfit I've tried with it. But I really like it. It's another super 60s outfit with my umbrella skirt and my gray turtleneck, gray boots, and cadet cap. Um, I've never worn this skirt with gray before, but I really, really like it. And I might wear these with, you know, my hose or whatever. Probably a lot of them I will if it's cold, but I'm just not putting those on and off. And then just the same skirt with black turtleneck and black boots instead. And then my wide brimmed hat. I really like this too, so um, maybe wear both. Maybe just decide on one. Sorry if you can hear the fan. I've had to turn it on high for a little bit, but here is my amazing vintage suit. I, I'll tell you all about this in a thrift haul at some point, but this suit is everything. It's my first ever suit that's actually, like, I wear my black blazer and my trousers a lot, but this is my first ever real suit. Um, so yeah, I love this. I have no clue what shoes I want to wear with it. I like it with my boots and I like it with my heels. And I just love this so much. Oh, I've always hated flares. I've always hated flares. But I love it with this. I cannot believe I love it with this, but I love it. I am totally wearing this twice, and I am wearing it with my teal turtleneck. Okay. Um, and I'm going to wear it with these shoes this time and with my boots the other time. Oh, I love this so much. I love mixing, like, greens and everything. It's, like, one of my favorite things right now since I'm so obsessed with green. 
Okay, so I know this is a look that can divide some people because I wore this once with my white turtleneck and cream shoes and I got some compliments on it and my friend then said I looked really dorky, but you know, everyone has their own opinion and I actually, I asked her for her opinion so don't think she was rude, <laughs> um, but, um, but yeah, so it can divide some people, but I really, really like it, so it'll be another maybe. I guess I just need to look over all the pictures and decide. Am I actually like almost done? Seriously? So I have looked through all the pictures. I have 16 outfits, so I need to narrow that down to 11. So I've moved all the pictures with the green blazer to one album so I can kind of pick between and the first one that immediately stands to mind that I want to get rid of is with the floral dress. I do like it but not as much as the other ones so that one is going to go bye bye. I have decided to keep the navy dress, um, the suit there and the suit there and get rid of doing the black with the green jacket because I mean it's more basic and I think the navy is a little bit more interesting. This one is a no because it can divide people so while I love it I'd rather go with stuff that I think everyone would think was cute. The gray is more interesting but I also love the black. How many other times am I wearing black stuff? Look how many I'm wearing black a lot like that though so I'm just gonna move that um, and not wear that, but I will say yes to the gray. So that means I have only three more outfits I can choose unless I decide to go back and take out other ones. Okay, this one's a no. Okay, I have one, two, three. Wait, do I have three and I only have... I have the perfect amount! Yay! Say no to that one made it the perfect amount. So... Let's look at my outfits. I'm actually going to be wearing a lot of green. I'm happy about that. Okay, my gray and black knit dress, which you can't see terribly well because I didn't have the lighting right then. But um, then my black formal dress, my teal and black striped dress, my lace dress, my um, navy dress with the green blazer, <coughs> my floral dress with the black turtleneck, slip dress with gray turtleneck, um, gray turtleneck with my umbrella skirt, the suit with teal, and the suit with black, and then my kind of top and skirt. So I guess that is it for part one, I guess. Oh man, I am so happy. That's finally done. It took me like three hours, but I've done it, and it was really fun for me. It's it was stressful, but it's fun for me. I don't know that's that's weird. I'm gonna have to edit this quite a lot. Here goes nothing. But I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next Sunday with a new video. Bye!